Uh. Jesus. Uh. Chloe actually uh, killed Frank. Can we just? She'll never forgive herself. Okay. Or let's let's this. let's. And only I can change it. I think we should not kill Frank. I think that it would be a, a good idea to not kill Frank, if possible. I don't think Frank is actually going to kill us. Listen, you know what I mean? Nicole, like he's an inconvenience. I can tell you for but a fact that this will not go well. Listen to me. Max, you know I'm right. Be kind and rewind. So tell me exactly what I need to do here. Not shoot Frank and his dog. Ah, fuck. Um. I know, no matter what, no matter what, we keep getting bad results. Her dad's dead, she's in a wheelchair, she killed a dog and a man. Um, watch your mouth doesn't seem good because we were the ones who set him off, right? Be careful seems useless. The dog's not gonna kill her. Right, so if we get rid of the gun... You won't like this, but you need to get If rid the of dog the bursts out of there no, for Max, some reason... I don't like that at all. But I trust you. If the dog bursts girl, out of there for some gun, reason, you better rewind fast. We'll, we'll, we'll figure something out. All right, let's see. I, Frank is not a bad dude. Like, shouldn't we be fine if we just watch yes. our mouths? Oh, yeah, really? I don't. Then why did you? I, I wouldn't say Frank is a good dude. Oh shit! I don't know what he just said. Close the door. Frank, uh, your dog is kind of scary. Could you please close the RV door? You aim your gun at me, but you're scared of my dog. That figures. Well, I'm just a teeny little girl, right? There's no reason to have any sort of weirdness with me, right? Okay, just gonna play on that. <laughs> Alright, see? Problem solved. Okay, there. You're safe. Now, what do you want? Just the names of some of your clients. Okay. Oh, is that all? Oh, well... <laughs> Well, why didn't you just tell me? How about I just give you the keys to my RV while I'm at it? Oh, this is what he said before. Okay, we said I'm sorry, and then he, he seemed to respond positively to that. Yeah, yeah, everything's important these days. There's no time for that, Frank. I, I just need a little bit of information. Yeah, yeah, yeah she would have gotten really pissed if we said watch your mouth. <laughs> Chloe, here knows all Chloe about doesn't that. respond that well to that kind of thing. Come on, Frank, this isn't about me now. Yeah, right, okay. Both of you are giving me a headache. No deal. Frank, we... Oh, yeah, you didn't come here to fight. I... I am so... Right. Finally, I believe you. I... I try not... Dude, she was scared. Right, makes sense, makes sense. We're cool for now. But my dog is... Right, like Mel and said, this is where we became best shit, friends. Best friends forever. You bite your head off. Okay. We're only here to talk... Shit, you wouldn't have time. You like dogs? Dog rescue. That went well of as well. I do. No. Uh... That's very... Maybe we can focus on rescue... Oh. Yes. You and Chloe do not know Rachel. <sighs> See, here's the thing. This is gonna get rough because... Yeah, <laughs> asking someone if they like dogs. <laughs> it's so funny. Like, yeah, but he's just trying to make conversation. <laughs> um, Rachel's photo, Rachel's letter, and oh no, maybe the bracelet because we saw the, the bracelet before, you not in Rachel's his RV. Bracelet. You obviously know more than you're telling. So tell us. Never come into my home and tell me what to do. Understand? Man, there is something about you that is so wrong. I don't Maybe trust you at Maybe we piss him off no matter now what. Get out of my face. We don't have much time, Frank. Rachel needs you. It's too late. She's gone. You don't even know her. Like you did? I loved her, asshole. And she loved me. I know that. Chloe, you don't know shit. You, you don't, don't know shit. Problem. Always trying to take her away from me. Always. Calm down, Frank. Let's just talk. I don't think he knows what happened to her. I don't think it's because of him or anything, but... Uh-oh. Uh-oh. 
How are we supposed to know that? You're the one who said don't pull a gun on someone unless you intend to kill them. You shot him. I know. You're both fucking crazy. What do you want? We, That's probably fine. We just want the code for your account. <laughs> I think we can yeah. live with this. <laughs> we didn't kill him or his dog. Down. You already shot me, all right? There. Now leave me alone, all right? Just just get out of my life. Do you want cool. to call an ambulance or Best case scenario, really? No, thanks. You know what? I'll manage somehow without the police. Oh, right. Let's bounce. You're so right, Mel's. Oh my god. I, I completely take back what I said before about Max saying the right thing all the time. She literally, it's like she either says the perfect thing or the worst thing you've ever heard in your life. And it's like, what are you fucking doing, man? Why would you say that? Why would you, uh, like, Shit. confront him like that? This could have gone way worse, but Frank might be more dangerous to call. Nah, it's fine. Yes, Max, you can change all this if you want. Nah. I think that's pretty much the best it was going to go. Yeah, I mean, he definitely could still die from that, but, like, he didn't in front of us, so I don't have to harbor any guilt. He'll be fine, probably. I wish we could oh, find out more from him, though. Okay? I know he knows more stuff, but I don't think he knows what happened to her. I don't think Sorry, he, you know, kidnapped I, I her or anything. I just thinking about shooting Frank in the leg. Please don't. You saved us. Frank is lucky. We have to keep moving forward. Yeah, I mean, he literally just said 30 seconds earlier, I don't pull a gun on someone unless you intend to kill them. And then he pulled a gun together. on you guys. How were you supposed to know that he, he was like, I wasn't going to do anything. Fucking bright eyes, Amanda Palmer, a sparkle horse. We're going bright eyes, man. What's hey up, Max, Chloe? see if you can put together all those Rubik's clues. Just holla if you need any info while I go online to make sure we haven't missed anything. Okay. Gather info on a character by selecting all the correct clues. For each section, there's a specific number of clues to collect. Thanks to David's own investigation, I should be able to find out what Nathan did during the party's week. Does David know what's going on with Rachel, or is he just paranoid about everybody? So that's Nathan, Max. What is this one? David really has been on Rachel's ass for a while. She should have been upset. You need to get rid of these damn cameras, David. Whose car is this? Look is that Nathan's? Look at all these license plates. I hope he was tailing Nathan. Oh, he was looking for a red pickup truck. Okay. I don't know exactly what it's asking of me. Well, there's two about Kate. There's two about Rachel. Two about Nathan. And then the coordinates? This makes no sense, Max. All right. <laughs> um... Looks like David was tracking somebody's car. Maybe even Maybe Nathan's. Even Nathan's. Good clue. Okay. Rachel. Rachel. Rachel? Looks like this is not relevant at all. All right, all right, all right. Oh, you're treading water, Otter. No? Okay. Try again. I'll have to analyze these plates and coordinates to see if Nathan was under David's surveillance. Um, Spy the so the Nathan plate coordinates? And that's all she Oh, wrote. okay. Please let me find some clues about Nathan in here. 
Oh, you would have tried it again, Sarah? I don't blame you. I, I, I think... I think it could have gone maybe one other way, but... I'm happy Let's with how it came out. Frank's drug deals during the week of the party. Frank's account book. But the client names are encrypted. Is encrypted the appropriate word? <laughs> They're not digital. <laughs> what is this? Frank is for sure Rocky, what are you the looking for dealer, bud? but... I, I doubt Rachel was carrying drugs for him. Right? Uh, yeah, I doubt it. So, what happened to Rachel after this? She dumped Frank, but... I don't think he would hurt her. Listen, Watson, you knew what she meant. <laughs> Rot must stand for Rottweiler. That does fit Nathan. Okay, Rot. so that's the encryption. Chloe's a bulldog, that's funny. Hi, Rocky, what are you doing, buddy? Where are you going? There's no doubt she Come here. him in some Come here. way. So weird how close they were, but Frank couldn't keep Rachel or protect her. Yes, the uh -oh. game is uh -oh. on. Uh -oh. Now, talk to us. Thought Rocky was going to pull my microphone. Tell out. us everything. Oh God! Let's see if I can find any deal Frank made with Nathan or the Vortex Club. All right. So let's see. Okay, Max. Remember these names and see how Nathan fits in with all this. So we need Rot, Bulldog. Those are the only ones we really need to care about. Frank sure is keeping his customers satisfied. He could open a store. Well, he's on this one. Everybody in Arcadia Bay must be high. <laughs> that explains a lot. No one on that one. If Frank applied this kind of detail to his life, who am I to talk? <laughs> I wonder what dog name Frank would have given me. Rocky, where'd you go? Bud. Oh, he's just wiping his little face. He's so cute. Um, okay, he's on this one. So top left and bottom right. I'm getting a contact high just reading this. It's a clever system. Hmm. <laughs> I mean, not really, because we figured Nathan it out really fast, but day. it's it's a fun system, Party I should supplies, say. No doubt. Okay, so it should be this one, this one, and this one. Oh, yeah. Yes. Those are all the ones with Nathan on it. These are all the times and places for Frank and Nathan's deals. Uh, that's it, Max. Uh, okay. What about these? Great. Oh, now, jeez, and rice, dude. Which car is Nathan's to match the coordinates? <sighs> what is that? I don't know. That's definitely Chloe's car. Okay, so Twin Peaks is Chloe's car. Wow, sir. This looks like an expensive machine. Interesting. Is this Nathan's car? Twilight Zone. Of course Nathan drives an SUV. Overcompensating. Overcompensating. Hmm. Who does this car belong to? Hmm. Okay, uh... There's Nathan dealing oh, to the kids up. right out in the open. Come on up! Come on, bud! You got it! Come on! Come on! You got it! Good boy! I had to lift the microphone cord up for him so he didn't trip. Hi! Come here! You good? You okay? <laughs> what are you doing? Hello. Oh, It's my little snuggle bug. 
Okay, what did she say? I wasn't listening. Oh, he's dealing drugs to the children. I'm glad Warren got his revenge. Yeah, it's pretty messed up. Um. Well, let's just to say assume it's the Twin Peaks one. Yep, another car David was tracking. Okay, so the top left is Twin Peaks. Oops, that's not what I meant. Huh. Who else was David tracking here? Okay. Why the hell are you following me? Twilight these Zone. And to where? This is Chloe, I believe. Celery and PB. Good snack. What is that license plate supposed to stand for? I keep wanting to say it's like sound effects, but I don't think it is. <laughs> six foot... Six foot... Nerd? No. I have no idea. Six feet under! Six feet under! Is that this one? No, I don't know what that is. Okay, um, so I'm going to guess, he's probably the Twilight Zone one, Six Feet Under, I don't know who Six Feet Under is, but, oh wait, no, Rocky, you're saying, I can't see my, my chat, you're so smart, bestie, thanks. <laughs> Twin Peaks, we said, was, uh, Chloe. TP Top Foot Hulk? <laughs> I don't know whose that is. Maybe that's Nathan's dad? I gotta be honest, I don't really know what we're looking at here. Which one's this? Twin Peaks. That's Chloe. Okay, we want Twilight Zone. That's six feet under... Okay. Oh, you're treading water. No. Water. Try again. Um. None of these say six feet under, though, do they? Oh, this one does. Okay, so what about this one, this one, and this one? Come on, deduce Nathan's license plate number. Then Why can't I figure out coordinates? which one is Nathan's? Okay, or maybe I did and I just chose the wrong one. Because it's this one, because it doesn't have... Oh, wait, this one, does this one have the broken taillight? It does! Okay, so it is. So it's six feet under. Got it. The six feet under is... Nathan's car, because he's crazy. Oh, yes. Now we're finally got getting it. somewhere. Got it, got it, got it. Chloe, let's plug in these numbers and see if they lead to an actual address. Aye, aye, Captain. Here we come, Rachel. We really are two incredible teenagers. <laughs> Where'd we get those pictures from? Damn, it's nighttime. Solving mysteries all day. Okay, now let's Max, look at Nathan's clues. I know clues. we can snap all these pieces together. Roger that. I'm gonna study the board and try to connect all these dots. I mean, what the hell are you doing over there, Chloe? I'm I'm doing all the work here. I have to analyze Nathan's messages. What could help me unlock this phone? There's a lot of numbers in here. Okay. This is the Vortex Club party where Nathan drugged Kate. Did he do the same thing to Rachel at another party? Oh, if God. there is a dark room, oh God, we better find it. Man, it's a good thing Chloe slipped all these files on her flash drive. It's like a stereotypical horror movie. Holy shit, Nathan is seriously unhinged. But those numbers, all oh, so busted. Nathan so Prescott has disrupted various classes of the past month despite every one trying to see to recruit out for some misholds. Hoida's class. Um, Nathan has enormous potential, but also erratic behavior patterns that may need supervision beyond our ability. Okay. 
Who the fuck writes a four like that? He's crazy. Why? What did he do? Where is? Oh my god. <laughs> it looks like a. It looks like a. It looks like a. A. a, a uh. What do you call it? A Nazi s. You know what I mean. Wouldn't put it past him. What about? Couldn't hurt to give this pin code a whack. Why do you put? Oh, because it's a prepaid phone card. Oh, there has got to be some good shit in his phone. I just need the code to unlock it. So how about phone, this, and this? Oh, we need four. Okay, this is just sad. All right, it's... don't be rude, all right? I'm doing my best. <laughs> Better look for any clues or numbers that could no, be his okay. pin code. This one, this one, this one, this one. This is one. like goddamn math. Nope, okay. This they one, suck. this one, this one, and the vortex party flyer. Nope. Nope. Maybe I should try this to one, link other clues This together. one, this one. I feel like the dark room one has to be part of it. I wonder if there's any important dates or numbers in his school file. This. Did I already do this? Okay, Max. Nope, there we go. Let's blow this code up and go home. Okay. Wow, a very threatening text. Get ready to fucking die, bitches. <laughs> sounds like you're. That sounds like your friend who parties too much, who's texting you before a party to like imply that you guys are gonna get super wasted at the party. <laughs> Doesn't even sound like a threat. I'm. St Let's start hacking. Oh, I have to actually figure out the pin. God damn it! Oh, I don't know, man. Ah, oh, I hate figuring shit like this out. I don't fucking know. Who writes nines like that? Why does this kid write like he's trying to reach us from another dimension? 9535. Let's try that one. Oops. Bad code. Yeah, just piss him off even more by laughing at how bad his death threat was. I'd for sure die. Yeah, I knew it wouldn't be that easy. You don't have to tell me the code yet, Bestie, but thank you for asking. I will probably ask you for it in a little bit because <laughs> I'm going to get too frustrated. Uh, what did I put in? 0058? Nine, nine, eight, eight. You locked it, dumbass. What do you mean? Oh my god. Fucking pain in my ass. Seven oh six three one oh one oh one nine eight seven oh six three. Seven oh six three? Was that on here too? It's not, but I'm gonna try it. That's what happens in real life. Mess up like three times back to back and it locks. Yeah. Ah, I forgot what I said. 7063. Have you ever locked yourself out of your phone? Oops. Bad code. Is it like a combination of these things? Yeah, but I knew the code. 
Did you just type it in wrong because you were doing it too fast? Or were you being stubborn? <laughs> 5431. Did we try that already? <sighs> yeah, I knew it wouldn't be that easy. Okay, I'm just going to rewind now. I mean... Oops. Bad code. Sleep deprived, yeah. Sleep deprived trying to put your code in your phone <laughs> and just lock yourself out. Um... Dude, I have no clue. One five four two. Yeah, I knew it wouldn't be that easy. You locked it, dumbass. <laughs> Oops, that's not what I wanted to do. That's fine. I'm so glad you're working with me on that. I don't fucking... What? I have no idea. Sarah, yeah, can you just tell me, please? <laughs> Sorry to ruin the fun, but I don't... 8103? Eight, eight, it's gonna try all the... Oops. Bad code. 0829. It's his beat. I was thinking of doing his beat day, but I was like, nah, that's gonna be too... Oh my god. I was like, no, they want it to be like one of the like one of the numbers that's like part of the code. My god. Thank you. Cause he's a basic bitch. You're so right. Bitch, you sold me water asshole. <laughs> Come down, bring it to me. Stay away, pigs on the beach. Yes. Uh, this is all about Nathan trying to score for the Vortex Club party. Nathan was jonesing hard the night of the party. He didn't have enough drugs. Drug dealer drama. It's Peruvian flakes, skidoo acid? The hell is that? God, Nathan. You're Need out of weed, etc. now. Meet Beach, be cool so this time. So it was you. Now I can officially call you a psycho stalker. Okay, so this guy fucked up for sure. No, Nathan. It's time for you to watch out. Asshole. Who is he even saying this to? Is this Rachel's phone? Whose phone is this? I thought this was Frank's phone. Is this from Nathan's father? That's brutal. Oh, this is this is Nathan's phone. This is Nathan's phone. I thought this was for I was confused. This is Nathan's phone. Does he have a slide phone? Why are all his texts horizontal? Yeah, this is a weird angle for us to be looking at this. Don't contact me at work. I chose to where I'm being high as an excuse. Where's his business? Not just a hobby. You want me to treat you like an adult who can get things done on his own? Impress me. I'd like nothing more than be proud of you. I'm not there yet. God damn. Talk about daddy issues. Okay. I like this. We're piecing. Oh breath, God, Max. I don't like it anymore. This is too much. Go through uh, all this data, and you can find out where Nathan took Kate after the party. <sighs> Fuck, dude. Is it the same day that he said he freaked out? 
ten four. Yeah, it is. I know, that's what I was saying, is Chloe's over there, like, fucking Googling shit. Okay, uh... What is- oh my god, this is so much information! Oh my god, I'm not in college anymore. I already graduated. I shouldn't have any fucking homework to do. Oh my god. <laughs> Girlgames.com fucking around. <laughs> She's on Disney.com playing that game where you helped Stitch build a sandwich. Or Stitch's cousin. I think everyone just looks this up. Yeah, I think you're so right because this is so much. But I'm going to do it or I'm going to try. up on gas. Why? No doubt that Nathan stays in his dorm room. So he could be hiding not much out there. A barn? Yeah, that's sketchy as fuck, dude. A rundown barn Nathan in the middle of nowhere. Bigfoot in the forest. Oh god. This guy's that an actual for real like murderer. Frank's main office. Oh, that has to be the Prescott estate. <laughs> Poor if Joyce knew what Nathan did to Chloe. She would fry his ass. Was fry Frank his ass. Him at the junkyard? So this was so ten four. This party was the fourth. At eight PM. These are from ten four. And it was after eight PM saying he needs shit ASAP, charge me double. Called to give him directions. That was 10-4 at 10.30 p.m. This was earlier in the same day. He already went there earlier in the day. He went there before the party. And then he went there again at like 10. This, I'm disregarding this. That was before the party. Ten seven. Don't come, fuck off. Okay. So don't need that. What else was going on on ten four? That's what I'm looking for. Okay, so he bought weed, speed, coke. Nine hundred thousand dollars, or is that nine hundred dollars? <laughs> that's nine hundred dollars. <laughs> Still, that's an insane amount of money to spend. Um, it's ten seven. He bought Molly and weed. Okay, this was the same day. This was the nighttime one. What the hell is GHB? And he went and bought acid later that week. And cocaine in the middle of the night. Ten three. Ten two, ten seven, ten seven. One one five. Come on, give me October fourth. Okay. Aha. The night of the party, in the middle of the party, he left and gassed up. Okay. This. This. Oh, I can't. Can I choose that? I can't choose that. Wait, is that the one? No, not that one. We want that one. Right. So that's when he was freaking out at like 10 o'clock. So we have him going to get gas, freaking out at like 10 o'clock. 
<clears throat> and then where's the one where he bought drugs at 10 o'clock? That's 10-7. We need October 4th at like 10 or 11 at night. That's the one. Those clues are not related. What? Fuck you! <laughs> this is on October 4th, 11 p.m. He bought five grams of what can only be described as GHB. Don't know what that is. And then this is the text of him saying he needs to score right now. No time. Charge me double. And this is him getting gas. That same night. How are those not related? Fuck you. This is why people look this shit up. Oh, maybe this one? This one, and then, uh... What was it? Come on. Yeah, that's the bitch. Chloe, this is definitely So he went the in, in the middle of the party and bought some... Easier crazy ass drugs and then went to this barn right after nope. nothing max there's nothing here there's some shitty old barn use your brain let's keep searching and find out who owns this haunted barn. yeah don't say nothing like i'm, I'm a honest. fucking don't hold on acting like i just spent all night doing this research like Somebody i didn't get anything out of it <laughs> aaron prescott yeah no shit I'm wow shocked. i'm so surprised <laughs> should we call the police Fuck that. You know the police here are like Nathan's private security, right? That's so messed up. As you've noticed, this so whole town is messed up. We can't trust anybody except each other. So we have to go out to that farmhouse by ourselves. You know what? You're so right. I was afraid it's never failed that. us before. We could call Warren since he kicked Nathan's ass. It's just the two of us, nobody else. And I'm not scared at all. Why don't you, you want to bring power. Warren? Hmm. I feel like we're this close to finding Rachel. We have to find her, Max. We will. But remember, my power isn't infinite. Yeah, I'm not we like a literal superhero. Do you hear, Chloe? Don't leave that up. Yes, sir. God damn. Everyone's gonna know where you are. Now our stepdad's gonna come. I guarantee Chloe's stepdad's gonna come find us. Yeah, it is. But we're here. Let's go find the best way in. You're right. There's only like four places in this town. There's like the school, the diner, the beach, and this barn. Whoa, <laughs> and Chloe's check house. Check this out. Fresh tire tracks. Don't step on them. Dude, somebody was just here. Then we Bust need it open. To Gotta find something to. Hmm. These are thick tracks and definitely fresh. Oh, look at the squirrel. Nathan's SUV? Watson, we can safely assume that this ancient vehicle is not our suspect. How can this town even afford her hoity toity school? It's true. It's all because of Nathan Prescott's family. I wouldn't want to do it again unless I had to. Well, that's good. It'd be worse if he said the exact opposite. Like, yeah, I feel great. I just want to beat the shit out of the next person I see. It's like a high. I just got to do it. <laughs> Dude, 10-4? The night? That was less than a week ago? That was like six days ago? That's crazy. <laughs> Is 
Let's see, birdie. Nice. Oh, we missed a few. That bird leg on the bottom left looks like a penis. <laughs> or chicken leg, whatever that is. Alright, what uh Max, get over here before I torch this place. Hang on, doing stuff. Chloe, I found the front door. Come on. I wouldn't call it a front door, but yeah, sure. Oh, yes. Maximus rules. Yeah, well, you were over there bitching at me. God, I was doing real work. Way too Blair Witch. I have goosebumps all over. At least it's daytime. Come on, Super Max. What the hell are those pictures behind you? Oh, God. Faceless man hey, in suit. This old chest. Bro, you were about to oh, find a dead wow. body for sure. Jeez, that is ancient. Jackpot. Old shit. No. It is just closer. a barn, but also it's scary. <laughs> They're not supposed to be there. <laughs> it means work, so it's spooky. Bring bomb shelter boom to town. My scrapbook. You search for more clues, and I'll scope out the area. Dude, I'm so hungry. I can't wait. I'm gonna eat some. I made left. I made lo mein the other night. So tonight I'm gonna have yes, some leftover lo mein. Yes, clippings. It's gonna be good. But that can't be the only. This tractor has paid its dues. Okay, there's no reason for anybody to drive out here. But there must be. Didn't have coffee today and your head is finally hurting. Oh, that sucks. I know the caffeine headaches too I well. I the Prescotts were just born bastards. Oh shit, from 1903? I'm writing in regards to your outstanding debts that you have chosen to ignore. The Prescotts may not be established business gentlemen, but we are businessmen and expect our due. Take your silence as a personal insult. Dedicate our family name to making you pay your debt. With 10% interest, plus a written apology, because you hurt my feelings. If these conditions are not met by the end of the day, July 24th in the year of our Lord, 1903, rest assured, we will make your life a living hell. Damn, so they've just always been like that. I mean, that makes sense. Generational trauma, uh, but not actually. It's really just, uh, you know, everybody keeps raising their kids in a cyclical wow, way. <laughs> Talk about home on the range. So this is what it used to look like. There's no way this rusty ass button will activate these ropes or pulleys. You don't think so? Boring. Boring. Yeah, I, I, I agree. I don't think we should press that. I think if we press that, it would if like actually shows up, I have collapse no the whole barn. Do you guys ever see that movie, The Crazies? That's what that that's what pitchforks always remind me of, especially with regards to uh zombies. <laughs> I haven't seen it since away. I was a kid, but it was really good. You saw it? I really liked it. Is that a a a, a trap door? Can we go under there? These hooks are used to lift haystacks. They were literally the only two people in the theater. I think it was like that when I went too. I don't remember there being a lot of people. I remember liking it though. Ah, <laughs> oh, the good old days. Oh, if only. My controller keeps shaking. Bro, I'm pretty sure there's like underground fucking shit happening. <laughs> There's some sort of... Whoa. Yeah. What is this? I don't like that. It's totally I don't like that. New. Chloe, get over here. Why? So many haystacks, so few needles. Do you think Nathan killed Rachel? Creepy photo. Check it out. Even Harry Aaron Prescott was into selfies. Ugh. Old. Old. 
You don't have anything to say about that? Okay, let's see. Um, I don't know, Nathan's kind of a big baby. Yeah, he is. That's a good point. But uh, big babies can also do big damage. If a zombie shows up, I have my weapon. He can't even make fours. <laughs> You're right. I just feel like he's already done. We've already seen him do fucked up stuff. He's drugged multiple friends of ours and done fucked up things to them. Who's to say he didn't accidentally overdose Rachel and tried to get rid of her, you know what I mean? Mm. I guess the press cuts were just born bastards. Uh, wh wh what do you want from me? Damn, lots of info here. What the... Okay, well, can you tell me about it, Bestie? Should I leave? It's not too far off, especially with drugs involved. Yeah. It's very easy for people to die or get, like, supremely hurt uh, when drugs are involved. It's funny how that works. Now, why would somebody run all that electricity into an old... Yeah, it's pretty park? alarming. This whole situation is, is very upsetting. I mean, maybe we shouldn't have left her in there, but that's her problem. She always ends up doing stupid shit, like just googling shit for 12 hours straight or looking through the boring old chest of paperwork. I'm doing the cool shit. That's her problem. What do, uh, what do they want from